Hey everybody, welcome to my AirPods Q&A Volume 2 video. In this video, I'm going to answer common viewer questions that have been asked throughout my various AirPods videos. Let's get to it! How do you answer phone calls with your AirPods? When your iPhone or Apple Watch rings and you're using your AirPods, just double tap to answer. Later you can double tap to hang up or switch to another call. How long does the AirPods battery last while on a phone call? AirPods get up to 2 hours of talk time per charge. If you charge your AirPods for just 15 minutes in the case, you can get over an hour of talk time. And a fully charged AirPods case has enough battery capacity to provide up to 11 hours of talk time according to Apple. Can you connect AirPods to more than one iPhone? Yes, you can pair them with multiple devices. I've personally had my AirPods paired to both my iPhone and my partner's iPhone in the past, with no issues other than the other person being able to prank me with their music sometimes when I'm using my AirPods. You just can't use your AirPods with more than one device at a time. How do AirPods charge? Are they always charging while they're in the case? AirPods do charge to full while in the case. Once fully charged, they stop charging until they need to charge again. The AirPods manage this on their own with no need for the user to worry about it. Does the AirPods charging case support wireless charging? As of the making of this video, the AirPods case does not support wireless charging. You have to plug them in using an Apple Lightning cable to charge them. It is rumored that the next generation AirPods will support wireless charging for the rumored AirPower charging mat. But right now, that's a rumor. But that would be a really cool feature for the next generation of AirPods. Here's hoping that happens. Does the AirPods support fast charging? No, but they really don't need to for the most part. It's a small battery and they charge quite fast. The case seems to charge to full from empty in about an hour, and the AirPods themselves seem to charge to full from empty in about 25 to 30 minutes in the case, from my experience. So there's not much point to adding fast charging to AirPods. Will AirPods work with my Samsung Galaxy, Pixel 3, or LG 7, or any other Android phone for that matter? Short answer, very likely yes. I know from experience they work with Samsung Galaxy phones, but at the end of the day, AirPods are basically well-designed Bluetooth headphones. So if your Android phone supports Bluetooth headphones, then you really shouldn't have much of a problem. The biggest difference is the ease with which they connect. You'll get a better user experience on an iPhone, but they will work just fine on most Android phones. To learn more about how to set them up on an Android phone or tablet, check out my video, AirPods with Android. I'll leave a link in the description below. Can you use the Find My iPhone app to track the AirPods case without the AirPods inside of it? Unfortunately not. Find My iPhone can only find the AirPods themselves. Neither the AirPods or the case actually have a GPS chip in them. The AirPods essentially piggyback on the GPS chip of the last device they were connected to, like your iPhone, and report their location using that. So if you're wearing your AirPods and misplaced the case, you won't be able to use the Find My iPhone app to help you search for it. To learn more about how to find your AirPods if they've been misplaced, check out my video, Find Your AirPods. I'll leave a link in the description below. Do you have an AirPods question I didn't answer? If so, I'd recommend checking out my updated AirPods user guide and tutorial. I'll leave a link for part 1 in the description below. You also might want to check out my first AirPods Q&A video to see if I answered it there too. If not, please ask in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer. If there's enough of them, I might just have to do a volume 3. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And while you're down there, don't forget to ring that bell and subscribe to the channel for more tech videos, including tech how-tos, every week. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.